Dolly Parton is the leading lady of country music, and while her talent is huge, so is her heart for others. And live anchor Katie Inman joins us now with a look at how this icon is making an impact on people of all ages across the globe. Katie. Yeah, Brittany, literacy is so important at every age. Dolly Parton has always known that, and that's why through her philanthropy efforts, she's known as the book lady, and for good reason. For decades, she has impacted lives big and small. Jolie, 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 Jolie. Dolly Parton never sits still. Just you can. Whether it's on stage or turning the page. Well, hello, it's Dolly, the book lady. Her impact goes beyond the blonde hair and busy schedule. And I think anytime you're working on good things, it energizes you. That's why she never seems to age. I said, well, I ain't got time to get old. Her heart for philanthropy beats a million miles a minute. She just wants to make sure that she's doing everything that she can to give back. Jeff Conyers is the president of the Dollywood Foundation. In 1998, that group formed a program called Dolly Parton's Imagination Library that gives books to kids from the time they're born up until their fifth birthday. Since then, over 200 million books have been gifted to kids. She's been such a blessing. She's, um, you know, a huge inspiration for us in large part because um, it, the program's so meaningful for her. Growing up in extreme poverty in Sevier County, she knows the importance of potential. My dad was a very smart man and I often wonder what he could have done, you know, had he been able to read and write. So that is the inspiration behind it. I actually got my father to get involved with me on it and he got to live long enough to see the program do well. And uh, so uh, that makes me feel good to know that uh, he felt good about the children calling me the book lady. He was very proud of that, more so than even my, my stardom. In 2022, she was even awarded the Carnegie Medal of Philanthropy for supporting children's literacy. I mean, this is home. Charity begins at home, right? When wildfires whipped through her home county in 2016, she started the My People Fund. We want to make sure that the Dollywood Foundation provides $1,000 a month to all those families that have lost their homes in the fires until they get back up on their feet. This Dollywood dreamer in chief even financially backed the Moderna vaccine during the pandemic. Vaccine, 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 vaccine. I'm begging of you, please don't hesitate. Her goal has always been to give back. We'll always love you. It is impossible to not love Dolly Parton, not only for who she is, but what she does for the community and the place that she calls home. Hey, if you have a child that you would like to sign up to start receiving those books through the Imagination Library, I have some good news for you. If you live in Tennessee, your child is automatically eligible. There are 15 other states across the United States that can also say that, where other where every child in the state is eligible. But if you live in a different area, you can always go online and figure out if they are eligible as well. Great, great program.